contra quem é que será o nosso primeiro jogo. Guys, I'm ready to show what I got. NBA, here I come, baby. It's now or nothing. Oh, you gotta love the positive energy in his first NBA game, folks. Happy Halloween here on opening day. I'm Kevin Harlan along with Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg. Are you as ready as we are? It's the NBA on 2K Sports. Glad you could join us. And a tip-off opening night, State Farm presents our starting lineups. First for the Warriors, Steph Curry is out there with Jarrett Jack. And at the pivot, a terrific defender and all-around player, the Australian sensation, seven-footer, Andrew Bogut. Then there's Harrison Barnes, and it's Lee in at the power forward position. And for Phoenix, Dragic and Dudley are the backcourt tandem. And at center, it's Mark Chingortat, the 6'11", versatile scorer and finisher, known as the Polish Hammer. Then there's Beasley, and it's Skola in at the four. You know, the last time the Suns were able to finish atop the division was back in 2007. Since then, they've managed to make the playoffs and be in the hunt more often than not. But that division title hasn't been for them. Green Man checks in, and the fulfillment of a lifelong dream is playing in his first NBA basketball game. He's one of the players who got a ton of attention leading up to the draft, and rightfully so. He's an amazing talent. Yeah, you know, Steve, he was high on every team's wish list. You knew somebody was going to make him a first-round draft choice, and this is it, his chance to show what he's capable of. We're going back to Phoenix and the division they play in the Pacific Division. It really isn't because how they play against their players. They're 9-5 and five against the rest of the division, Steve, last year. Yeah, they've done a nice job over the years uh, within the division, although the Pacific is now getting tougher with the emergence of the Clippers. I think Golden State is on the rise. Sacramento added Thomas Robinson in the draft, so... Uh, things will not get any easier for the Phoenix Suns. Morris kicks to Brown. Sinks the triple. Brown's got five points so far. Boy, they are not messing around here, guys. They are really banging the glass hard early on. Plus five margin already in rebounding, and it looks like this is going to be a factor all game. Rain Man makes the bucket. An important momentous occasion for this young guy getting his first points in an NBA uniform. Well, the thing you always hear about him is just how hard he works. And you know, he's going to have to go above and beyond to improve his game, but you know he's willing to put in the time. And, you know, let's be honest here. When you don't have the natural talent or ability of a lot of players in this league, you've got to make up for it in other areas through hard work, attitude, effort. And he understands that. Out of bounds, Phoenix will take possession. Where was he going with that pass? I mean, that's just an awful turnover. Sebastian Telfair, he's checked in for the Suns. The Suns trailing. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Hey. Deflects the pass. Now here's Jenkins. Guarded by Fry. 14 feet away. Kept alive. Here's Rain Man. He kicks to Tyler. The feed to Jenkins. He dishes it to Jefferson. A second chance effort. The shot no good. That's not an opportunity he fails to convert very often. And so, lots of scoring in that competitive first quarter. Warriors lead by one. 2K Sports, back in a moment here from the U.S. Airways Center. Nothing like NBA action, so come out to a Warriors game and enjoy the show. Single game tickets are available to make sure you see Rain Man take on the opposition. So come out and welcome our sensational new rookie. Obrigado, obrigado. And welcome back, 2K Sports presentation of the NBA. What a season in store for us. And the Warriors, guys, what jumps out to you in this game, uh, stats wise? And I like what they've done offensively, really attacking the rim, getting a lot of points in the paint. And guys, they've been the aggressor early. I mean, attacking the hoop and getting into the paint. That can make the game really easy for you. Lee gets the bucket. Well, you love his motor and the effort level that's there on the offensive boards. That's always there. Right. 
ಒಂದು ಸಿಂಪು ಕುಂತನ್ ಬಿಟ್ಕೊಂಡು Here's Rain Man. He's covered by Brown. That's good. Oh, And it's a tie ball game. The Suns have gone 5 of 8 from the floor here in the second quarter. Over 60% shooting. You know, the Warriors would have loved to have made the playoffs last year, but after hanging around in the playoff chase for a good part of the season, basically decided to pack it in and get ready to rebuild for next year. I think that's the right move. Let's check out what Doris Burke has for us. Yes, Kevin. Well, for Andrew Bogut, the former number one overall pick in 2005, it seemed he was destined for perennial all-star status. But terrible luck with injuries has held him back and called into question his durability. He said, it's the stigma that I've always heard. It's frustrating to be labeled with that. But at the same time, I have the motivation to try and come back and prove I can stay injury-free. Now on a new team with the Warriors, his goal is to help them win games and make the playoffs. He said, with team success, the all-star stuff will come. Kevin, they're hungry in the Bay Area. Well, Doris, the Warriors are hoping that he can be that presence in the middle that they've lacked for a long, long time. Decades even. Thank you for that report. Yet the Warriors had a lot of ground to make up when they made the decision to start playing those rookies. Still, you know, would have been nice for the fans to be able to get the Oracle mm -hmm. Arena rocking once again. We still have the great fans out there, Steve, but uh, they're obviously looking to the future. Well, that's one of the reasons they made the big trade with uh, Monte Ellis going to Milwaukee for Andrew Bogut. They're trying to improve their defense. They're trying to get bigger and stronger. Well, they've got an unbelievable fan base in the Bay Area, and I think they're amassing some good talent. I, I think uh, the future is bright for Golden State. There's the triple. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Andrew Bogut. That's his first foul. Well, I love the fact that he's fighting hard on the boards, but, uh, you know, you got to be smart, too. Over the back, that's an easy call there. Well, that's simply the result of poor position under the glass. But at least you can't fault him for being passive. He was trying to be aggressive there. Jared Dudley's checked in for the Suns. Here is Telfair. One fifty-one left to play here in the second quarter. From deep, another three for Phoenix. That's how you extend the lead. I mean, they have tremendous confidence going for them right now. And that confidence is leading to some excellent shooting. Here's Rain Man. He gathers. And Bogut slams it in. Look at that effort. Does he set a great example out there or what? On plays like that, he does. Sure, what, what work on the offensive glass we see with him. Yeah, that was awesome. Put back with the slam. Are you kidding me? Brown outside. From downtown, Rain Man snatches it inside. Solid advantage in the rebounding totals for them so far here. You know, in every game, but particularly in a close game, every little advantage you can use helps. And they're certainly enjoying one on the glass here. Telfair kicks to Johnson. Here's Brown. The Warriors pull it in. Landry's got three rebounds so far in the game. Jenkins with it, picked up by Brown. Gets it to go. Suns have gone 7 of 14 in the second quarter, shooting to the tune of 50%. There's 37 seconds left in the first half of the game. And the Suns miss again. Great defense there. You really have to challenge him at that range. Here's Rain Man. There's the three. Rebounded by Dudley. The Suns shooting for the game at 42%. Now Telfair, pass to Johnson, a three ball, the shot is off. And here is Jenkins, and unable there to get the go-ahead bucket. It's all tied in Phoenix. Stay with us, folks. And now, brought to you by Sprint. Yeah. The spookiest day of the year, Ooh, Halloween. Really? truly really not that scary. Yeah. Not during the 2K Sports Halftime Report, anyway. The Suns are battling hard in this one. This game's lived up to its billing. Two fantastic teams duking it out. They've been making smart passes, protecting their possessions. Fundamental basketball's a beautiful thing to watch. 
But you know, the Warriors also came to play. They've done a fantastic job pushing the break in the tempo. Easy buckets in transition. And that'll be it for us here. Thanks so much for joining me. Now it's time to head back to Kevin Harlan, Steve Kirk, Clark Kellogg, and Doris Burke. We hope to see you around next time. And welcome. Suns lean by three. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. And it's Brown missing. Warriors have gone 8 of 16 in the third quarter to put their second half shooting percentage right at 50%. He feeds it to Thompson. Shoots over Brown. Thompson misses. And here we go with Kendall Marshall. Goes up to the stripe. The shot misses. Scola passes to Dudley. Got it. Good job in the low post. Dudley's got five. Well, it's been an exciting game. Plenty of offense as we head to the fourth quarter. As the fourth quarter gets going, let's swing it over to Doris Burke to find out who's had the sprite uncontainable game. Doris? Hi guys, our uncontainable game tonight, Mr. Shannon Brown. Energy, passion, key plays. He's provided all of them from the bench. So the Suns win. Both teams played well, but these guys have the edge. Yeah, I think. Incredible. Não fiz post nenhum. Muito bom. Muito bom. Bom só. E aí temos o nosso, o nosso primeiro jogo da NBA em que marcamos 6 pontos em 6 minutos. Não. O que é que vai se passar na. Now that game one of your NBA career is in the books, how would you rate your performance? Well, I obviously didn't play too many minutes out there, but I felt like I was doing the right things during the time that I was on the court. So, I feel like I can grow from this performance. You know. We. Só uma pergunta. Bom, ok. Ficamos assim então, só com uma pergunta. Até ao próximo jogo, pessoal.